So today what we were doing is focusing on, well actually two components were happening today. We had the beginning students working with basics of GarageBand, with EQ and compression and how to mix stuff together. And the advanced students were working on a rough track that then we're going to multi-track so we have everything separated out. And then the advanced students are going to do their own mix with compression, EQ and so on of the, the individual tracks. The beginning students are going to pick one of the advanced students' compositions and mix it down. Then we're going to compare mixes and see how well people did with that and talk about, because it's a very subjective thing. You know, add more of this or that. But the idea is that uh, everybody will be doing a mix of a song that an advanced student had done, and the advanced students will do their own mix. We used this when we recorded earlier in the year, when it was in the green room. Yeah. It worked pretty well as a stereo mic over the top. And that's where you record Chandler stuff. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, it does judge yeah. stuff because we can do the kick and stereo in the back and then do the stereo on the top. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, we're going to do it. Where's our Johnny Clinton? Are you doing any vocal stuff? No. Okay, I'm going to do that. What's the latest you're going to play? What's the loudest you can play? I don't know if you're going to play. Jeez. Let's do a Okay. Um, everything sounds pretty decent here. You get the scratch track, I think that's fine. Yeah. You guys get it? Sure. Okay, give me one moment. I don't know what I can do, though. Okay, I'm recording off the board, and I'm also recording stereo mics right here. Uh, you gentlemen may start whatever you want, but I definitely, because you're going to be listening back to this in the headphones when you layer on your track. And so having a quick, something you really need. Good for you, what you might want to go is one, two, three, four, then start that because you're going to have to know when to start to stick up and stuff. Heck yes. You know what's great about that? <laughs> something that the, the levels on my side, everything wasn't quite right. We got what we needed for a track, but it's all practice. The point is, I wasn't dialed in right until halfway through. So it served a really good purpose. So tomorrow, when you do it again, we'll be better, you know, better ready for it. If we haven't used that mic today, and it wasn't there crisscross on the mixer. Again, not your problem, our problem, but we fixed it.